Ice. All right, so how can you safely, right, if you don't have these? Yes. I know you love wearing these. View the solar <laughs> eclipse this Monday. Yeah, they're kind of cool, huh? Then you can't, can't read the prompter it. at the same time. That's right. So. Well, Christina Ernie shows us what you have in your home you can use to safely watch it. We all know the solar eclipse is just several days away, but what happens if you don't have time to get these ISO certified eclipse glasses? Well, we all know that you cannot look directly at the sun as the eclipse is happening. So how else can you view it safely? Some household items actually might help you. The first thing is a pasta strainer or a colander. All of these circles will actually help to reflect the solar eclipse, but here's the key. You can grab one of these and step outside during the eclipse as long as you're back is to the solar eclipse. You hold up the colander and the eclipse or the sun will be shining through these holes reflecting off of the pavement or perhaps a wall that is completely blank. You'll see all of these circles projected on the wall or the pavement in front of you. And as the sun begins to eclipse, you'll actually start to see these circles turn into crescent moons. That's a very simple way of doing it. What if you want to have an arts and crafts project with your child? Maybe you've done this before. You take a box and you make what's called a pinhole projector. You cut a hole in a box and you can put aluminum foil right over it. You take a pinhole make a very small hole and on the inside of the box you have a white piece of paper that acts as your projector. As long as you hold the pinhole window up to the sun, you should be able to see the reflection of the circle and then that eclipse take place inside of the box. And what if you want to get a good photo of the solar eclipse? Well, as long as your eyes are protected, you can take another pair of these certified glasses, put it right over the camera lens of your phone, hold it up to the solar eclipse, zoom in and dial back that brightness. And of course, be sure to submit your photos to us on turn to 10.com slash chime in. I'm Storm Team 10 meteorologist Christina Ernie. Yes.